Call of Duty Toronto launch party where fans like myself have been waiting to find out the name of the team, what's the branding going to look like, who's on it, as well as what sick merch we could get in order to rep our city. So enough waiting, let's find out. with Dominique, general manager for Toronto Ultra. It is official. That is the name of the team. How does it feel to actually get it out in the open? Uh, it's really hard to keep a secret in esports, especially Call of Duty esports. So to be able to share this with the world and know that, you know, there's all of this work and blood, sweat, tears, excitement, and to finally just celebrate with this one big party, perfect way to start off the season. I'm here with Methods. Now it is official Toronto Ultra. What does it mean to be representing the city and being one of the first to put on that jersey? Yeah, I think when this league was first announced, I definitely wanted to solidify myself on one of the upper echelon teams and landing here I think is pretty much a dream come true. I don't think many teams have uh, a city like we do. I think there's only a couple that come to mind that can even compare, so I'm, I'm happy to be here. Uh, it means a lot. I mean, uh, I, was, I play for Splice, which is obviously a part of the overactive media. So it's kind of, I kind of knew I was going to probably lead into playing for Toronto. And I'm just glad that we were able to make it happen and can't wait to represent the city. Walk us through what does it look like branding a team that represents not only the players, but also the city. Yeah, so this team is incredibly diverse. Uh, you know, we have players from all over the world, all of the major regions. We speak more than a handful of languages on this team. And it's really great to have a team that really represents all of the, the values and inclusive nature that Toronto has to offer. Yeah. I'm here with Mayhem, who is the only Canadian on the team. How does it feel actually now putting on the jersey and being among the first to put on the jersey and being Canadian? Uh, for me, it's just like, I don't really think much into it, you know what I mean? Because in Toronto, like, we're all diverse, just like our team. So for me, I'm just glad I get to represent Toronto and, you know, I'm just ready to play. I'm ready to get the season started. And you're from the UK, which is kind of like our parent country, right? So how familiar are you with Canadian culture, with Canada and Toronto? Not familiar at all. I'm familiar with similar weather, not as extreme, but I mean, I'm excited to try it. I'm, I'm ready to try some poutine. Well, how would you handle the cold Toronto weather? Because you, you come from a place where there is no snow. Yeah, I come from the beach. So it was warm weather year round. I didn't really know what a winter is. And if you wanted to see snow, you went up to the mountains. But now it looks like I have to go do some shopping, buy some Canada Goose or one of those high-end winter clothing stores. Some Tim's. Cold. Yep. I, I might do Tim's. How familiar are you with Canada and the city? Not much. I've only been to Montreal once and then Toronto once, but when I was in Toronto, I was here for a quick tournament, so I got to explore a little bit. We checked out uh, the mall, I think it's called the Eden Center, yes. but that's pretty much uh, the most I've seen. Definitely when we come live here, I'm definitely going to explore the city, just from watching and just from seeing you know, the city from the outside point in. And everyone always gasses Toronto. Uh, my friends from here, so they always come and just party out here. So I know it's going to be a good time and can't wait to know more about it. Going into this season, what are you and Toronto Ultra going to bring? We're going to bring like some fun vibes. We're having fun with it. People will see with this reveal that we're kind of joking around, having fun. Um, just not, we're not trying to take it too serious out of game. We want to have some fun, you know, have some friendly beef, friendly rivalries. But in game, you know, we'll be serious trying to win them championships. Uh, Canada is quite diverse, so we're trying to take that uh, approach as well. Um, and just trying to, trying to make fun of everyone else, you know, try to create some storylines and then have some fun. I mean, listen, I'm just going to be cocky, you know, like, I'm just trying to win events with the team and we're going to see how far we can go. And, uh, you know, like our whole brand, we just want to be confident, like we're not going to take any shit from people. And yeah. And there you go. That's it. It's official. The Toronto team for Call of Duty is Toronto Ultra. And I know I'm going to be repping them when the season kicks off in the new year. But now I'm going to just celebrate and dance the night way.